Hey guys, Big Anthony here. It is Tuesday, March 31st, 2021, and I'm here in the van doing a test with my new Jackery Explorer 1000 right there. And you can see I have the DC power port on with my Dometic refrigerator plugged in. And it is a pro it is 1.30 p.m. now. I've had this refrigerator plugged in since um, 12 p.m., around 12 p.m. It got down to temperature and now is operating. I put a few items in it that were cold already. Some iced tea, some Gatorades right in there. So I've got that hooked up and running right now, primarily on the Jackery. So, and the compressor just kicked on. You can hear that. So we should see the watts rise on the Jackery. It was operating at two watts, and now it's at 35 watts as the 45 watts right there, as the compressor kicked on, and the battery's reading 99%. So this is running solely off the Jackery 1000, this Dometic CFX 45 refrigerator, or CFX 40, I believe it is. <clears throat> now I'll put the specs to this in the uh, description box. I'm gonna be testing this Jackery out on a few different items this week. One of them is this Proctor Silex uh, little water boiler there that's adjustable. I think it's a max 1000 watt. So that should be able to heat up water for me uh, with the Jackery. So I'm gonna see how that works. And then this Elite Gourmet uh, like coil burner. That's also max 1000 watts and has an adjustable gauge on it right here. So I'm gonna be testing those this week as well, but I wanted to do the refrigerator and just see how it runs today uh, through the day on the uh, Jackery. I had my Rock Pals 100 watt folding panel hooked to the Jackery, but I wasn't getting any any power into the Jackery. I think something's wrong with the the eight millimeter port connector on the uh, Rock Pals. I've got to call Rock Pals up and see what the what the deal is with that. When you plug in the eight millimeter to the Rock Pals extension cable. It really doesn't make good contact. It seems like it's not holding. And therefore I think it's it's um, not transmitting the power into the input, the eight millimeter input on here on the Jackery. So I wasn't getting anything coming in to the Jackery from that panel. And it's pretty sunny today. It's a sunny day, as you could see out here. So that's a little question that I had on what was causing that. So. It's either that or the panel, for some reason, is not compatible with the Jackery. I don't know what else it could be. So I will uh, let you guys know about that, and I'll keep tabs on this refrigerator throughout the day today. I'm going to have it running till sundown. I just want to see how the battery performs during the day, kicking this refrigerator on and off. This is the Jackery Explorer 1000. This is Anthony uh, signing off. Stay ready, questions, comments, like, subscribe, and uh, we'll put this uh, Jackery through its paces. <clears throat> Thanks for watching. Take care and stay ready.